everybody. I'm your man, Dennis Pittsburgher, Power Auto Media. We're here in the Edelbrock booth at the SEMA Show with my good friend, August Cedarstrand. And you guys have taken the tried and true, the good old-fashioned carburetor, and made it better. Tell me about what's going on with the AVS-2. Well, I'll tell you, we started with our Thunder Series carburetor proven performer and to that we've added annular discharge boosters to it now so we've taken a great car we've taken a good carburetor and now made it a great carburetor increased drivability increased power increased mileage it's the best thing since sliced bread really well let's talk about that because you and i love the simplicity of the carburetor you know it, and there's something a pure art and almost a joy to tuning that carburetor correctly but you guys have made it where now low end power low end drivability and throttle response dare i say approaching fuel injection style very close to it very close to it for a carburetor it, the performer's always been a great street carburetor very easy to tune very easy to drive it still has all those features but with the annular discharge booster now there's even more bottom end torque more throttle response everything's a lot better in that bottom to mid range on it there and it still has your air adjustable air valve secondary door just like the thunder series is known for like i said we've taken a good carburetor and made it great well, let's talk about some of the other options that you can get with the AVS-2. Now, talk about the, the availability of different carburetors within the lineup. Not a problem. We have carburetors in our Performer Series and our Thunder Series. They're available from 500, 650, 800 CFM and finishes from our standard ball burnished finish to Endura Shine to powder coated, powder coated black. We even have a Marine Spec carburetor, Coast Guard approved. Now let's talk about response from the people out running these. Now, when we were talking earlier, you had said you got a few of these out in the field. They won't give them back. No, no, no. That was the thing. We sent out some test samples for people in a questionnaire. And uh, after they drove it, set it all up, they're like, uh, no, I'm keeping it. <laughs> we couldn't get it back. I think we got one back out of the several dozen we sent out. So they love it. What do you think the biggest thing is of why people love us so much? Now, obviously, there's a lot of technology built into this and a lot of R&D. What is that one thing you think you can pinpoint that why this carburetor is going to be successful? Drivability. Drivability more than anything else. You know, a lot of people are switching to fuel injection, which is fine. You know, it's, it's, it's the next wave. But we still make hundreds of carburetors a week. So I don't think the carburetor is going to go anywhere anytime soon. You got to keep innovating or you, don't, or you die, you know?